Ikhwani, when you want to sin. And when you want to do something wrong. Ikhwani, remember the one that owns everything can see you. Don't make Allah aqbahu al-nadirina ilayk. When you lie, when you trick, when you fall, when you speak wrong, when you act against your religion, you respect others and you wouldn't want them to see it. But when it comes to Allah, you do. And who's better than Abu Bakr as-Siddiq radiallahu ta'ala an? Abu Bakr used to say to the people, istahyu min Allah. Be shy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. فَإِنِّي وَاللَّهِ أَسْتَحْيِي مِنَ اللَّهِ I feel shy of Allah. That when I go to do my call of nature, Abu Bakr Siddiq, when I go to do my call of nature, Wallahi, I veil my face. حَيَاءً مِنَ اللَّهِ Because I'm very shy of him, subhanahu wa ta'ala. Abu Musa al-Ash'ari, the great companion he was, he said, Wallahi, مَا اغْتَسَلْتُ قَائِمًا I never had a bath standing up, ever. I mean, I never straightened my back. بِمَعَنَا مَا اسْتَقَمْتُ ظَهْرِي I never straightened my back. Why? Abu Musa al-Ash'ari was said he always used to have a bath sitting down and he would have, have it in a dark place. Why? Because he was shy of Allah. He didn't want Allah to see his aura. He didn't want to show Allah this. The shyness of theirs reached an extent that the companions, they came to the Messenger sallallahu alayhi one time and they asked him, Ya Rasulullah, Advise me, a man said. He said, Oh, Sini, Ya Rasulullah, give me an advice. You know what the Messenger وسلم, said to him? He said, Istahyu min Allah. Be shy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Kama tistahyi min rajulin salih min bani qomik. Be shy of Allah. The way you would be shy of a righteous man of your best of the people that you're from. If you see a person in your righteous people that you're from, you will never dare to do that in front of him. Be shy of Allah as much as you see that. No one would ever dare think of the best person as the most noblest in your eyes and try to, to picture yourself in front of that person. How would you deal with it? You will never dare to do that. Then remember, don't make Allah the one that you belittle more than that person.